going to be the mid-month for July 2020. So, y'all know the deal. Check your house placements. If this is not your story or does not resonate with you, it may not be for you. Okay. Just a weekly okay? Okay. okay. So, hmm, mm, mm, mm. you dealing with a Virgo or hmm, you, you in hindsight about something. Mm. What's the blockages? What's the indecisions? Okay, what's the message for my Aquariuses for this mid month of July? What do they need to know? What do they need to see? Uh -uh. You dealing with a fire sign? Oof. Are you dealing with somebody older? Mm -hmm. An empress, masculine feminine energy. Could be an Aries, could be a Taurus. But that's your business. Five in the deck. We have the seven of wands. Mm. We have the full, and we have the nine of wands. Could be dealing with a fire sign. Heavy fire right here. But Aquarius, either somebody's defending you because they're not trying to hear any kind of bullshit that's going on, and maybe somebody wants to take that leap of faith. Mm. But you got you got two people. <laughs> Are you dealing with two people defending you? Okay, you got somebody like not nah, uh uh. Uh-uh. Aquarius is mine. Damn. It's like that, Aquarius? Somebody looking like, mm -mm, nah, Aquarius is mine. Shit, are you dealing with two fire signs? Mm. Or do you have placements? Mm, I'm hearing somebody got a Leo moon and a Leo Mars. Ah, Aquarius, Aquarius. I ain't even mad at that. But the point is, that's your business. You like all in your element like, nah, I'm going to take a leap of faith. I'm going to do what I got to do. Mm-hmm. Your ass is leaping somewhere. Uh, but you could be fighting. Uh, two people could be fighting over you. Shit, cause we got <laughs> the Five of Pentacles. Could be dealing with Earth sign. We have the Magician. You dealing with a Gemini? Maybe the Ace of Cups. <sighs> Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. If you have two people you're dealing with, hmm, apparently somebody feels left out. Okay, and they're like, God damn, how can I get to you? Your ass is in fire energy, and you air. I mean, shit. I mean, either way. You can manifest anything that you want. But the point is, are you dealing with a Gemini? Because somebody wants to manifest something with you. Somebody wants to manifest love with you. If it is two people that you are dealing with, I don't know. Or you like, now nah, fuck it, I'm going to just self-love myself. <laughs> but the point is, we have the Ten of Pentacles. Mm, we have the mm, King of Swords upside down. Reverse. Okay? And then we have Judgment. Either you or another fire sign. Mm, we got fire too. Or an air sign like yourself. Shit, you were a Gemini. Shit, somebody's like, nah. Somebody's in full just in fuckery mode. Like, mm -mm, ain't trying to hear this shit. I mean, either way. Or perspective too. If these two people are fighting over you, your ass got to make a final decision. You're like, nope, I already said what I said. And damn, it's like to a point where you're like, mm mm. You was all right. Like, yeah, okay, I made a decision. But then shit, if these two people are fighting over your ass, you're like, listen, I said what I said. Well, goddamn, Aquarius. <laughs> Aquarius said, I said what I said. Aquarius made a final decision. But somebody wants stability with you, okay? Somebody wants to build a legacy with you, an empire. What are you going to do? Or you just like, now, nah, fuck it, let me just focus on my money. <laughs> but we have the boot, okay? Are you dealing with a cancer? Are you dealing with a Pisces? We have the six of swords okay are you dealing with air sign and then we got hmm, death scorpio what are you gonna do there was some kind of secret okay and maybe you're like listen i don't want to deal with this no more and you just want to move away but are you manifesting new love and you're like nah this shit's in the past your ass is moving forward but for some reason are you going back <laughs> what are you doing or is this person like damn aquarius done Left me out in the cold. They probably know you manifest in their love. And they want to come back because they're like, damn. You don't, what is it? You, uh, you don't always get what you want. But somebody is manifesting you back. Because they didn't know what they had until it was gone. That's what I'm hearing. 
You don't know what you got until it's gone. Shit, let me find out. And somebody now wants to come back in like, mm -mm, I want Aquarius back. Aquarius is like, listen, I'm evolving. Are you dealing with a Scorpio? Mm. But are you manifesting new love? What you gonna do? But somebody's looking at you with stability and with fulfillment. But somebody wants to defend the love with you. But we have a seven of swords. We have the seven of pentacles. And we have the king of cups. Are you dealing with a water sign? Because mm -mm -mm. with two sevens, we got self-confidence issues. <laughs> cause of instability. And listen, Aquarius is like, listen... Shit, you are a mad scientist. You're like, I am the mad scientist. <laughs> you know what you want. You're very intellectual, okay? You may not wear your emotions on your sleeve sometimes, but the point is, you know what you want. Are you in this energy now? Or is somebody trying to present something to you? And Aquarius like, listen, if you want this, you got to definitely invest what you want with them, okay? Because you know what you invested. But you definitely, your back is turned towards the seven of swords. You're like, listen, uh-uh. Are you turning your back towards another air sign? Or are you just in the energy like, I am not for the fool system fuckery. I am not for the deception, okay? And shit, if there was a, a third party, you're like, uh-uh, uh-uh. You're not trying to hear that shit, mm-mm. You moving forward. You're like, I want new love. And is this why you're holding your ground regarding the situation? Mm, only you know. But on a different perspective, you got three sevens. So you got luck on your side, Okay. And you're like, listen, it's in your favor, okay? Because we have the Hermit, we have the Ace of Swords, and we have huh, the Chariot. Are you dealing with a Cancer? Are you dealing with another ass sound like yourself? Or are you dealing with a Virgo? Point is, your ass looked at all this. You were in Hermit mode, okay? You were in Hermit energy. You grounded yourself. You deeply went and reflected within and said, nah, I'm looking at all this shit. I can't deal with two people who want to fight over me. You're going to take a leap of faith. You know what you want. You want to build something with someone. You're going to manifest new love. You done put everything behind, anything in the past, and you're not dealing with the foolishness of fuckery. You made a final decision. You made it known. You told them what you said. You was pretty much in this energy, but like, you're like, nah, fuck it. I ain't fighting with these two people. I said what I said. And if it was a secret, your ass ain't trying to hear it. You're not dealing with any deception or any lies or any foolishness of fuckery regarding the situation. You're like, nope, I don't want all these parties. But these parties, you done took the shit. You done left the other two. But now you're in your emotions, okay? But you're thinking smart and logical and strategically. You knew something. The truth came down and your ass is moving forward. I know that's right. Mm, mm, mm. But somebody want to offer something to you. Somebody want to come back and apologize to you. What you going to do, Aquarius? What you going to do? Mm, mm, mm. Only you know. But, got two aces, too. It's mm -mm -mm. a new partnership. You moving forward and do love. Okay, I ain't mad at that. Mm -mm -mm. What is this? A new romantic cycle begins. What did I just say? I just told you, you had two aces, new partnership, and a new romantic cycle begins. And look at this. You see, somebody wants to come in to be something to do to you. Okay. And their ass is going to defend your ass. Like, fuck what everybody else said. Aquarius is, mm, they going for Aquarius shit. <laughs> hey, you made that Aquarius shit. We got let go of control issues, which you definitely did. Because you was like, listen, I'm not trying to hear this shit. The truth came out. Mm, mm, mm. And you're calling your soulmate. Mm, what you calling in? A new romantic cycle begins? Listen, cards don't lie. What you going to do? Mm. And when you meet that person, your ass is going to retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. I mean, shit, Aquarius, y'all already know how to disconnect. You're like, listen, I'm a motherfucking Aquarius, okay? You know what you want to do? You mad scientist. But somebody going to make your ass happy. Mm. It's going to be a surprise. Ew. Somebody else said that earlier this month. It says, in a way that you wouldn't expect, a gift from the universe, intense twist of fate, eclipse new. Mm. Your ass got a surprise, okay? Mm. And it could happen in the wintertime. What you going to do? But for the meantime, your ass is discerning. Mm, mm, mm. Could you let go of the control issues? I need more of that. Mm, mm, mm. And calling your soulmate could be next year. Hey, it is what it is. <coughs> well, you know, next year you could be retreating. Whoever you with now, whoever you're dealing with, you could move to the next level. Mm, and it could be possible marriage. But that's your business because you got to do what it goes. Could be with a Gemini. Mm. Could be with a Scorpio. Something's going to happen within the next moon cycle, okay? 
and somebody sees you very sweet somebody wants to celebrate with you somebody wants to offer the cup of love to you and we have double moon here okay you could be dealing with a cancer you could be dealing with a pisces okay because the way it's looking you got two decisions either between a gemini or you have a choice between a scorpio but that's your business okay but you're going to be in empress mode or emperor mode masculine or feminine energy and you're looking at just like shit i got all these offers what are you going to do mm, mm, mm. so that's what i have for you for the rest of the month a new romantic cycle is going to begin something could pop up next year do it love only you know take care